In this video, we will show you some steps that you can try if you're having trouble logging into your Orbi system when using the URL orbilogin.net or orbilogin.com. First, make sure that your Orbi router and satellite are plugged into an active power source. If your Orbi devices are on, the power LED light should be green. Then, make sure that the device you are using is connected to the Orbi wireless network, also known as the SSID. If you need the default Wi-Fi login information, it is located in the product label on your Orbi router. If you change the default Wi-Fi login requirements, or if you are having trouble connecting to the Orbi wireless network, try a direct wired connection. Use a computer and an Ethernet cable. Connect it into one of the available ports of your Orbi router. If that fails, try using the Gateway's default IP address, 192.168.1.1 or 10.0.0.1. If you change your router's default IP address, enter the new address instead. If you need help determining what the IP address of your Gateway is, watch this video. Using the Gateway IP address will take you to the Orbi system interface, and you can make configuration changes that way. Once you finish configuring your system, and you can connect to the Orbi Wi-Fi SSID, if you still cannot access the Orbi system interface using orbilogin.com or orbilogin.net, then it is possible that those URL are cached in your browser. Try accessing the interface using a different web browser, or clear cookies and cache. If you still can't get to the configuration interface using the URL, it may be necessary to power cycle your network devices. If none of these things help you gain access using the URL, you may have a static DNS resolver set on your device. Configure your device to receive an IP address automatically. As a last resort, reset your Orbi kit to factory default settings. To learn how to do this, watch How do I reset my Orbi Wi-Fi system to factory default? To learn more about this and other topics, please visit us at community.netgear.com.